then I highly recommend making more appliances came. A little bump day. Oh my goodness, that was so much stuff to carry in. And I actually look like a literal crazy person right now, but it's moving day, so I really don't care. It's actually pitch black outside. It's only 6.50 right now, so almost seven. And Nick is on a bachelor trip in New Jersey. And we did our final walkthrough yesterday and our builder gave us the clearance to move in. Of course, Nick would be gone this weekend. And I didn't feel like waiting until he got back to move stuff. So I just moved all of this stuff here that you saw me carry in. They're really not heavy boxes. It was just a lot of back and forth. So I'm out of breath, but I am here. Sorry if it's really echoey. Obviously there's nothing in here, but I thought it would be fun to like go ahead and start organizing the kitchen and everything like that. I don't know everything that's in these boxes cause they're pretty much all miscellaneous, but I did label them like one could have kitchen, bath towels and like office supplies. I really have no idea. So that's what we're gonna find out, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and start washing up some of the dishes and putting them away, finding their spot, everything like that. And yeah, so obviously this is our moving vlog. So welcome to the vlog. I hope that you guys enjoy it. And I am so excited for whenever the boys get back so we can actually move our furniture, um, like bed, couch, and actually stay here. It's Friday right now and we weren't supposed to move until next Friday, which is March 1st. So we're a week ahead, which I'm so grateful for because obviously if you're moving into a house, it's super exciting and the patience is, you know, you gotta try and be patient, but it's just an exciting thing. I was about to say I was gonna do an empty house tour, but I feel like you guys have seen it empty a bunch of times at this point. So I'm just gonna wait until we have majority of our furniture in here and then just do like a finished house tour, I guess. So no house tour, but let's go ahead and start moving. Wow, honestly couldn't look worse. I, the ponytail is really just not for me. Um, but I clearly just washed all of our Tupperware and I'm trying to figure out if I'm gonna stack it like this. Can you see that? That, or put the lids on all of it and then stack it in. I'm gonna cut my finger, that's okay. Um, but I was about to go ahead and start washing our pots and pans. And I think I said in my last video, it was like a big home haul. So we got all Drew Barrymore stuff basically. And so I wanted to show them. So here they are. They're just white and then they have a gold handle. So cute. So I'm gonna go ahead and let these just soak in here. And yeah, then we'll put those away too. Okay, so I just put our towels. These are like a really pretty green color. I know they look gray on camera. But just set our towels in there. And it's like eight something, so I'm gonna have to wrap up soon and actually go home because, well, it's just getting late, so. Um, but I put my plant in my office. Okay. And then baby girl's bathroom. I just put her rugs in here when they're so cute. It needs to be streamed. And then same one in here. And put her bath towels in here. Well, these aren't hers. These are for her guests, but they match her little baby bath house and here's the bump. All right, and we're here for day two of moving. Can we take a moment? I look a thousand times better than I did yesterday. I think yesterday I looked a little sick, um, but I was just, I was just working hard. So looking much better today, but yeah, we're here for day two. I just brought in some things and then, oh, in our microwave, my sweet, sweet grandparents just, brought all of this over from my house, or my dad's house. So I'm slowly just gonna be picking from this and bringing it in one thing at a time to see what we can get put away. Um, but my papa and my uncle actually built this table and side table. So this is our side table. So 
stinking cute. And so we'll put our couch here and then we're gonna do two swivel chairs, chairs here and then probably a lamp on that side table. And then I just put all of these blankets on here because I just washed them and I need to put them away. But this is gonna be the coffee table and it matches. I just love like the bottom of it, how it's, I don't know what you even call that, but this is our coffee table. So I think that's gonna look really cute. Obviously, whenever everything's in here and we get the rug and all of that good stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and start putting the stuff away. All right, I put the blankets here because this is the linen closet in the hallway. So I feel like that's a good spot for that. Here is my cup situation. I've got Nix Bialetti, some coffee cups, glasses, and then like the cute glasses and like cups I'll use every day. I don't know, it's so hard to decipher what goes where, but this is what I got for that right now. I said all of the boxes are so miscellaneous, like I just found pumpkins in a box and stuff that I cut hair, Nick's hair with during COVID, so very random. And here is our toaster, I'm gonna open this up real quick. I also just changed shirts because I was already getting a little hot. So, oh yeah, this is, I don't know where I'm gonna put this yet, but maybe we can put it in our pantry. This is the Drew Barrymore toaster. Gorge, gorge. I just found my next problem. And it is the microwave. So, Drew Barrymore, <laughs> of course. Um, so here's the microwave. Now, it looks like it's not really taking up that much room and at least it's really pretty, but it cannot stay on the counter because I, I just like, I feel like it takes up way too much counter space. It was supposed to go in here in the pantry, which don't mind the tiny little food that we have. Um, by the way, my grandparents must have dropped off this stool because it wasn't in here, like it's not mine, but I did need a stool. So that was good, thank you, Grandma. The microwave is gonna sit right here, but the shelves are way too like skinny or whatever. So that's why I put that plug in in here. I think we're gonna have to get a little rolly cart maybe to go under the shelf, but then I feel like that's like way too low to be down there. I don't know. I just really don't want it to sit on the counter because I mean, this is obviously like all the counter space that we have and that's right beside the stove. So like if you're cooking, I just feel like that's not the vibe. Okay, after this, I promise I won't talk about Drew anymore anymore, but I just opened up the air fryer. Oh. And the crock pot. I just love how everything is touch screen. I think it's super cool. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna manage to put these in the top shelf of the pantry. All right, it's been a little bit, so I thought we'd do an update. This is gonna be above the fridge. So I put like all of our Stanley's, Yeti's, Hydro Dugs, um, workout shakers, all of that good stuff up there. Then I did all of the bacon stuff down here. So I switched the pots and pans because I have a lot more baking stuff and then moved the pots and pans right here. Just built our laundry basket. So that's right here. This is like the only silver thing in our house. But um, yeah, so I'm probably gonna put this in our closet, but for now it's just gonna stay in our laundry room. All right, so that is all that I'm gonna do for now. Um, I'm gonna go back home See if there's anything else that I can bring over. Um, I do have some heavier boxes, so it just, just depends on if my dad is done rabbit hunting or not, or if Gracie can come help me or something like that. Um, might not be done for the day, but I'm at least done for now. I'm gonna go eat some lunch because I'm actually starting to get hungry. Good morning, guys. Happy Friday. We are back in the house today for some more unpacking. Look at this super cute outfit I got from Target the other day. Are you kidding? little bump date we are 31 weeks as of yesterday yesterday was february 29th so baby girl is getting big and growing tomorrow is her baby shower and i'm literally so excited i think it is going to be the baby shower of my dreams and everything that i pictured it would be so i'm really excited for that and i'm gonna vlog that as well i think this is gonna be my last day vlogging unpacking for now at least like i'll still do um I also do like organization videos and like fridge, pantry, all of that good stuff. But as far as like 
unpacking unpacking i think this is going to be my last day vlogging that because it honestly just slows down the process and it could probably get a little bit boring but we got mail how exciting is that our first piece of mail i know it's junk and it doesn't even say our address on it so it probably just got put in there at random but we still got it so that's exciting and i've literally got the wi-fi guy he just called me and he is on the way right now so i'm so excited to have wi-fi and i'm just flipping excited let me show you this yeah that's our couch how flipping cute is that with the coffee table side table now we've got some work to do obviously but moral of the story is the couch also the dining room table yes mm -hmm. let me turn on the light stunning gorgeous so our appliances were not supposed to be here until actually we've had some issues with those but they were supposed to be here like in january then in february and then it was march 1st and which is today by the way and then it was march 10th earlier this week and then yesterday it switched back to march 1st so today i was actually i was actually kind of really peed off about that because uh, while well, we're moving in we need appliances obviously so we took my dad's fridge from the basement and put it in our garage and we were just going to use that and then make do with everything else it's our dishwasher um because this is just a loner dishwasher right now for the sake of the inspection um dishwasher stove and refrigerator so we took my dad's refrigerator from the basement and put it in our garage and now we're just gonna have to take it right back over there because our appliances are coming later today and i'm so 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 excited it's definitely not the best day because it is going to be raining a lot but anyways we are just so excited and i cannot wait to show you the appliances i think they're going to be gorgeous all right little update so we got up baby girl's shower curtain it's obviously a little bit wrinkly but it matches so perfect in here it's just like tan and white basically um got this set up I, i'm gonna put a little picture of her right here like in the bath or something obviously there's gonna be a while before we get that so maybe like her ultrasound or something like that and then also let's see what we got in here i started bringing in clothes from the closet oh we put our mirror right here in our room so like our bed will go here and then bam, mirror cute and then i started bringing in some clothes so this is my side not quite sure how i want to do it yet i just kind of throwing it in here and Brought in some suitcases and stuff. And that's pretty much all we've got for now. I did find this cute little sign that I'm going to put on the garage door. And I'm going to get a wreath for the front door. Alright guys, so the appliances came. We got these in. Um, this was a whole situation here. And it has a gap back there. I know you probably can't tell. But I think we're just going to deal with it. But got our appliances. Let me turn on the lights so you can see a little bit better. Obviously they're white. They're so cute. We have obviously literally no groceries. So gotta go grocery shopping, but that's that. And then we got our stove. Then our plumber's gonna come on Monday and switch out the dishwasher, but it's literally the same exact, like it all came in a set. So um, it's just gonna match everything perfectly. And that will be gone. Got our towel hook up and we got our baby here. Do you love it? She's a little confused and unsure and we just got her stuff but we're making a little setup right now it rained like all day today pretty much so we didn't get to get our bed so we're gonna sleep on our couch put the tv in here and eat our pizza we just got back home and ordered pizza because obviously first night in the house you're gonna order pizza but i told nick what a candy salad was and that we should make one and the dude loves candy so he was not opposed to it at all so we're gonna make one i'm gonna show you what i got so obviously container sweet tart ropes mike and ike's sour skittles extreme nerd clusters and then these two items are actually just for fun we're not going to put them in there i don't think but we wanted to try the green ones for easter nerd ropes so let's go ahead and make our salad while we wait for our pizza
Okay, this is actually the perfect size because it's actually a really small container and we do not need a big salad, that's for sure. But oh my gosh, I like the best candy is in this. Oh, got sour. I highly recommend making one of these. Also, that's gonna be it for my unpacking videos because I think I should just do the rest not vlogging because like I said, it kind of just slows down the process. We also have baby shower tomorrow, so we've got a lot to do and I'm gonna vlog that as well. So honestly, I should need to charge my camera, but thank you for watching today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it and I will see you in my next one.